Hello beautiful people of the internet, it's Izzy here and I am back once again with another Legacies episode after a three week hiatus because I feel like we're just going to have a bunch of hiatuses at this point. Um, so today we're going to be reacting to episode 13. Um, I don't remember the title so don't ask me. <laughs> but yeah, this is a very Jed centered episode which I am so excited about. Um, I wasn't so too excited about this episode because I wasn't sure what to expect um, because the trailer kind of didn't give anything away. Um, but Ben Levin, who plays the wonderful Jed, um, went live on YouTube, or YouTube, went live on Instagram today and took over Legacy's Instagram account, and we are finding out Jed's backstory tonight, and it just made me even more excited for the episode. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to get my intro done, the episode starts in like 10 minutes, um, but yeah. Let's just get straight into it. Hello, beautiful people of the internet. 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 <laughs> oh, I don't trust her. Oh, it's a witch. Oh, shit. Shit. Hi, baby. Require some help. Yes. No, I got this. You can help me anytime. And what is, but it's going to be a confetti cannon for Headmaster Saltzman's surprise party. Oh, my God. Really? <laughs> Oh, they're so cute. Is it that obvious? I have no idea. Checking out your man? Let me <laughs> Yeah, he totally is. <laughs> ben definitely knows. <laughs> he definitely knows. There's no way he doesn't. Oh, fuck. Where's Hope? That. Oh god. Ah, not here. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about I this. She can tell us where the rest of her made down Don't bring back Tristan. Why don't you just trust me with the math? For a billion reasons, none of which you can handle hearing. So just keep going straight for a few more miles. I need to get home. Good luck. We'll bill you for the cane. Sorry. <laughs> okay. You can put it more in pain, please. Crisis, which I could tell Hope though. Probably not, because you guys don't want to scare them. How about Hope or Landon? It's gonna be Hope. Watch it be Hope. It's gonna be Hope. It's gonna be Hope. Watch it be Hope. Cleo's right. Oh! You're gonna give him a heart attack. Oh, hi, baby. You have a problem beyond the cane, obviously. Doctors say I'm lucky to even walk. And if I could, I'd probably try to kill you for murdering my daughter. <laughs> However, I may have also... Oh, my God. ...accidentally started a chain of events that has led to the gods returning to our world. And I'm pretty sure those gods want me dead. You should probably get one. Look, in my opinion, this is no different from when Malifor came into our lives. Salvage our school that always sticks its neck out for the good of the world and all. Oh my god. I can't stand Alari! You are the adult, so be an adult. Make them do whatever it is that you want them to. All roads lead back to Lizzie with you two. Hmm. That's okay, because my god problem is your Lizzie problem. How are we supposed to find I mean, she's not wrong! Convince them trust issues. This car is a freaking metaphor for our partnership. You said you had toxic. Thank you! I would do anything. Well... We'll see. <sighs> okay. I'm vamping into town to propel us a new car from ground. <gasps> Any questions? Okay. Uh, you need to get out so the squad can talk in private. <laughs> Let's face it, Caleb. There's been nothing super about the squad since I left. I mean, look around you. Lizzie and Josie are gone. Where's Jack? Boy, she wolf. You're no longer capable of using my powers. Okay. Well, then I guess that brings us back to Caleb's demand. Who's the new guy? I'm quite ancient, actually. And the guys you speak of are my extended family. Oh, ben and Hope seems. Hope, what did you do? Ah! You love her so much. Make things worse. So, I got you one. Not that I knew you'd be showing up or anything. You trick. I'm right about. Oh my god. god. Is this one one thing? Perth. As much as we don't want monsters knocking at our door either, protecting innocent. Oh my god, I love them. On the squad. Why? So you'll be defenseless while you get eaten alive? Yes, that's 
generally how it works. Hell no, that plan makes perfect sense, Jed. So what is your hesitation? Okay, look, I've been waiting for the right time to tell you. And today at the confetti cannon would have been better, but I chickened out. Now it suits me fine. Continue. So trust that, that Continue. no matter what you have to say to me, I will... <laughs> What the fuck? Fuck you. Why did I hate him? Hmm? Oh my god, I knew it. I fucking caught it. I freaking caught it. The bite is making him see things as of, as his older self. If I don't kill this monster, Jed's only gonna get worse. Is this the monster you saw? Very much so. What is that hideous thing? A clown. I ask myself that question a lot lately. It's simple. You don't. I do. It is your fault that Jed is hurt. <laughs> you guys are stuck here on the grounds with Bozo. Oh my god, I love her. I you know, I have a better plan. <laughs> I Jed's love her so much. I, I could say the same to you, only because you are completely disconnected from reality. But oh my god. I'm listening. Her hair looks so much better this episode. I think I know what our monster is. Thanks to you and Wade. And I think that we can use this monster to do just that. Oh my god. You with me? Why not? <gasps> Wait a second. I know what they're fucking doing. Oh my god, it makes sense now. Yeah. Oh shit. Oh my god, I knew this was gonna happen. Oh, the fucking clown. Oh, Do you have any idea what you're asking me to do? Shut up! Banking with Capital One is the easiest decision in the history of decisions. <laughs> Even easier scared. than this. <laughs> I had no momo right there for a second. Oh my god. Keep out, dude. <laughs> oh, I love her. Suck on that, Aurora. Oh shit. I knew it. I fucking knew it. Really? See? Style. I would enjoy this map, this uh, scene much better if no, come on, he wasn't in it. Back. This is a clown delusion, and I'm over it. <laughs> Obviously not. You're not over being forced to kill Landon. I'm your humanity, and I'm trying to return. You know it. You're just a coping mechanism. You're the one yelling. So right now, I'm just a tiny voice in your head telling you what you already know. But I will grow louder if you don't listen. Because I am, and always will be, your better half. I don't know what just happened. Oh no! Jed! Uh, at least someone here is an account. Pick up that damn bat and use it. I will. Be 
by my side when we revived. Something oh, baby, oh my God, stop. Our discussion? So I killed him instead. That's how I activated my curse. Oh my God! That clown wanted me to. I'm guessing this friend was Trey. No, he might have been more than that. Now that I look back on it, I never saw Trey again. And that's the part I regret. It's not who I am. That's right. Oh my God. Stop. I'm ready to let go of the person that my father wanted me to be. I swear to God. Are they gonna kiss? in progress I'm not fucking okay I'm in I'm, I'm high on emotions right now oh what the fuck bullshit like what fucking news is this to <laughs> fucking sell the fuck up ever since you get kids fucking stupid so you missed the Lizzie and Aurora stuff too yeah okay yeah we missed all that shit <laughs> The way that I thought this shit was a joke, like, I kid you not, I was like, this is a fucking joke. I saw, why like, the skyline, and I was like, what the fuck? He said, why this weather, bitch? And I screwed it. That's not exactly what I was going to say. I am the adult. And sometimes I mean telling kids like you things like this. We don't need you. Oh. Yeah, you drink, you drunk-ass motherfucker. These aren't pathetic tattoos, they're a blood pact. But what makes us most alike is that people have always made us feel as though we need to be fixed. But we don't need to believe them when they say we're broken. I mean... That's borderline empowering. And who's the new dude? My name is Aurora DeMarco. And it is very nice to meet you, Jennifer. I wouldn't blame you if you just let me ride with you. I just wanted to bring you something to eat. You bring me a human. It's not going back into your trip, the real stuff. Hey! Bitch! You can't do this shit to me! Damn it, Lindsay, I told you. Did you really think you could get rid of somebody for you? This episode has been freaking amazing. Um, thank you guys so much for tuning in. We got Ben and Jed. I can't do this. I can't. In the middle of a Danielle scene too. What the fuck? Oh, we'll see what happens. I'm gonna figure it out at some point. Oh my god, we got a hand in scene. We got a hand in scene. I can't do this right now. Okay guys, bye.